What's going on? So I'm just coming back from my uh, Trent Radio Training CFFF FM 92.7 in Peterborough, Ontario. Trent Radio. My show is going to be on Tuesdays between 4 and 5. Uh, if you live locally, you can get the station. Uh, it's going to be called Warehouse of Strangers Radio Radio. As I'm going to try to kind of um, simulate what I do with my Facebook page, Warehouse of Strangers Radio. If you're not a part of that, I know I'm always saying check it out on Facebook. You can join. It's a public group. Anyone will add you, as long as you're cool. I'm just hitting uh, downtown Colorado. Uh, mm. Beautiful downtown Peterborough right now. Just noticing the changes. I, I rarely walk downtown these days. Every time I come downtown, something's different. It's really weird. I guess we're about to, we're about to pass a bar. This is where a lot of kind of live music for the older crowd happens. Black Horse Pub, like a lot of the more established uh, Peterborough musician types play there, it seems. This record store here, uh, Blue Streak Records, this is a fucking phenomenal record store. People come from all over. It's better than any record store in Toronto. Guarantee it. Mm. Got a big fat dipper snuff in right now. But yeah, we're just hitting down, hitting downtown here, and uh, what's going on downtown? So that's a uh, that's my old band, and that's why that's why I don't play with them anymore. We won't go into that though. Yeah. Yeah, cool. We have poster boards. We have a, uh, it's a long history of the, the, the local musician postering war in Peterborough. And a bunch of years back, they so everyone he didn't stick posters up all over everything. They gave us a bunch of specified poster boards. I'll show you them as we pass them. But, uh, yeah, it's a really nice day downtown Peterborough here. We're about to pass uh, the spell where uh, the, my latest album with Hurricane Charlie, me and Jill Stavely, was uh, recorded for their annual Garage Rock Festival in the summer we call Fuzz Fest. And uh, see if we can get them in the shot here. Yeah. Love this place. Love it. Awesome place. Mm-hmm. It's weird being downtown, man. I never fucking go out. I never, not, not downtown anymore, really. But, uh, I don't know. It's got its charm. But yeah, I just kind of wanted to tell you we had, uh, we had this cool training session for the radio. And uh, so I learned how to turn turn things on and turn them off, and how to play music. They have turntables, they have cassette players, they have uh, they plug in my phone, which is great because a lot of what I want to do is actually on vinyl and cassette stuff, like old tapes that uh, bands from my original fanzine Warehouse of Strangers used to send me and. I still have, hopefully they still work, but uh, we'll find out, it's all doable, it's amazing, we're going to walk on the shady side of the street, because I'm a shady motherfucker, you know what I mean, this is one of them poster boards I was telling you all about, so, uh, see what I mean, yeah, posters, 
kinds of shit going on. Nothing I'm really too interested in seeing, I guess. I don't know if I'd stop. Mmm. Mm hmm. What else will be passing here? The Cajun restaurant I used to work at, we're going to pass, but I'm going to try to not put that in the shot because I try not to talk about that uh, the name. Uh, there's a building across the road where my uh, ex-wife Mithra used to have a really cool underwear store called I See France. And then this time last year was a pot dispensary. It got busted. And it became like a bong shop that closed because we got a better local bong shop. And uh, now it's locking up for rent again. Well, that's cool. It's kind of funny. What we're in right now is called the Fashion District of Peterborough which consists of like three shoe stores and a fucking couple boutiques of clothing. Bridal boutique, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, I tried to hit the garbage can with my spit. It didn't work. kind of worked. I hit the, the metal part. I'm gonna dodge this car here. Passing the ghost mall. This mall is like the weirdest mall. There's nothing really in it except weird shops nobody was into. Hi, Andrea. That was my friend Andrea. And, uh, yeah. See, so, yeah, you see people downtown Peter Pro. Ah, that was a big fat fucking lip. Got snuff all over my phone. <coughs> all right, man. So yeah, the fucking clock tower. I guess it's gonna take me about 45 minutes to walk to and from this uh, radio show. But that's cool, cause I need the exercise. Hey, ho. I call this quits, but as soon as I get home, I'm going to be making a recipe in the meth end of town out of some uh, rice vermicelli that I got at the, the food bank. I'm going to show you how to do something with that. Until then, over and out. Stay free. Keep rocking in the free world, you know. And uh, be well. And I'll talk to you soon. Over and out. <laughs>